Hello everyone, Mike, Newfound Pass with this week's What Sold video. This week we have 20 items all on our main eBay account and we are just going to jump right into it. First off we have the Toastmaster Deluxe 2 uh, Sliced Bakery Toaster, model number B720. This is vintage, made in the USA, new old stock, brand new in the box. This was really cool. Picked this up for about five bucks. It was long tail, but that is A-OK. -okay. Check that out. Nice, shiny, clean slots. You know where the toast goes in there, the bread. It had this little, that's what happens with old plastic and stuff. See that little, and there may be a film over that, but I wanted to make sure to get a good picture of that. But because this toaster was obviously not used, but it had been in the box and, you know, maybe been stored somewhere damp. So did have that on there. But other than that, it's super clean. Now check that out. Obviously not used. Too clean, too clean. But anyway, picked it up for five bucks, and uh, had this listed for originally for sixty two forty eight. Did a uh, thirty percent off sale, and that's when it sold for at forty three dollars and seventy four cents with free shipping. As about ten bucks or so to ship that. Next up, uh, this went really quickly. This Nordic Ware William Sonoma Octopus Cake Pan. My wife picked this up for just a few bucks just a couple weeks ago. Got it listed up and instantly was getting, you know, good amount of watchers on it. And I listed this high. New ones were selling for this price. And this one I listed as used because it was used. Uh, you know, no sticker, no box or anything, but still in really good condition. But uh, new ones were selling for the price I listed it at. $55 uh, with free shipping. There, there's the Nordic Wear label, but we, like I said, we only paid a few bucks for this, five bucks or so, and uh, sold really quickly for full asking of the fifty-four ninety-eight uh, with free shipping. So that was a really nice quick flip on that one. Next up, this Peter Millar merino wool sweater vest with the Chicago Cubs logo on it, brand new with the tags. Uh, picked up a lot of these, and this is uh, they've been long tail, of course, but. Uh, Picked these up for five dollars each. Uh, I've got had several other at the same time, not with the Cubs logo, but of the Peter Millar sweaters, sweater vests. Yeah, brand new with the tags. Let me get down here to the tags. There it is, quarter zip. Yeah, really, really nice. Uh, paid like five dollars for this. Had it listed for fifty-two forty-nine with free shipping, and that's what it sold for. Full asking fifty-two forty-nine with free shipping. Next up is the Keen Hiking Boots. These are a women's eight and a half with soft wraparound toe. Uh, these are pretty desirable. Uh, Keen's are a really good brand. Pick, these were in not ideal condition, but still okay. I only paid $5 for these at Salvation Army. I had these listed for, uh, you know, 50 originally, 30% off, $34.99 with free shipping, and that's what they sold for. $35 free shipping, which was about eight bucks. So, yeah. Check out your Keens if you see them in the thrift store. Next up, this Eddie Bauer Goose Down Reversible Vest. Uh, one side had this kind of a, I didn't even know how to describe it, so I described it as a brown, a barnwood brown. <laughs> and the other side was a dark blue. And check that out. And there's the uh, tag with the Goose Down. And the other side, really, really dark blue. Really nice vest, super nice. Paid about seven fifty for this. Had this originally listed for 50 bucks at our discount of 30% off on our sale. So that's what it sold for is $35 with free shipping. This did go to uh, California. So shipping normally would be high on this, but I uh, was able to, it's a good thing about goose down. You can uh, get it rolled pretty tightly and uh, fit this in a padded flat rate envelope. And the buyer has received it and very happy with it. So it worked out really well. Next up, a Christmas item, the Santa mug, the Coca-Cola Santa suit coffee mug. This is a large one. Um, picked this up for our usual, you know, 50, 75 cents a dollar or so. Had it originally listed for $36.09. Had our, dis our sale on with 30% off, and it sold for $25.26 with free shipping. And this sold on March 10th, and this is a Christmas mug, so really cool. Uh, you know, $25 for a mug is good any day of the week, so yeah, we'll take that really nice condition you know the combination of the coca-cola and the santa suit and it was a very large mug too and check the bottom out there with the coca-cola branding clean no spoon stir marks very important yeah really nice mug 
Mug life. Yeah. Next up, the Calmar Designs Teak Modular 40 CD uh, CD rack holder. Every time we see these, we pick them up, and every time I list them, they sell. I uh, picked this up for just a few dollars. It even had some chips in the top of one rack right here. See that right there? That was his only condition issue. Other than that, it was, it was good. These are meant to be modular. You can stack these on top of other... Uh, other racks just like this one see it has the uh the holes right here and you would invert them like 90 degrees and just stack them up so yeah pretty cool there's the calmar designs uh had this listed for 31 dollars 23 cents with free shipping and that's what it sold for full asking free shipping and the shipping was about 10 bucks on this item so yep next up a nike checkered white and brown plaid pink women's golf bag <laughs> i got this for really cheap like five dollars um i tried to sell it locally for a long time and you know no takers and stuff i listed it on ebay and you know I, I shifted to free shipping and shipping was significant on this like 20 bucks uh, so i ended up only profiting about 10 bucks on this and i so i'd probably pass on this next time but still made a profit you know took up storage space for a while but uh it did sell for the uh, 43 dollars and 74 cents but being in it only for five dollars and shipping was 20 you know final value fees and everything profit was pretty slim on this so lesson learned you know you got to take the good with the bad next up this was awesome see that was bad this is good <laughs> this uh crayola endoseptic chalk number 1400 this is when benny and smith owned crayola pick these up in one of those job lot bags we pick up quite frequently for only a couple dollars uh, not too long ago this was in a haul video probably two or three weeks ago so you can go back and check that out and you know if you don't trust my word which i'm sure you do but uh, yeah just two or three bucks in had these listed for uh, 75 dollars for the lot for the box of uh, five boxes uh, with free shipping and that's what it sold for full asking of 75 dollars with free shipping on this so yeah super super nice sale so next up we have the maryland, maryland renaissance festival mug stein uh, whatever you want to call it <laughs> uh in our area we you know we're really close to maryland we have us in northern virginia washington dc and then maryland right there all in you know within just a few miles of each other and uh we pick these up all the time for just a buck or two and uh they sell pretty well um we picked this one up for like a buck you know and uh had it listed for 29 dollars and i just listed this not too long ago and it sold like the next day so i was trying to list some you know older stock that i had sitting around but like i try to do you know you always want to delve into the old back stock uh, i listed it for 29 dollars, and it sold super fast 29 dollars full asking with free shipping and this just went to maryland someone in maryland so shipping was about seven and change on this so really nice next up we have the knit picks uh palette yarn <laughs> five skein skeins whatever you say how you ever say that uh 100 wool uh my wife picked up a whole lot of these and this is the last uh, batch of these that sold we sold all the rest of them really quick had this listed for 30 dollars with free shipping and i sent out a batch of offers you know like we can do now and i had sent out some uh, offers to watchers for 20 dollars with free shipping and someone took me up on it so it worked so i got 20 dollars free shipping glad those are gone we only had you know a buck into those so still good profit next up the under armor heat gear polo well, washington nationals double extra large brand new at the tags and uh had this listed for uh, 43 dollars and 73 cents and this is another one where i sent out an offer of 35 dollars to watchers and somebody took me up on it they paid 35 dollars free shipping this did go first class it was only like four bucks and change to ship so yeah, really nice sell, sending out the offers on that. There's the new with the tags, and I only had about five bucks into this, so really, really nice sell. Next up, oh yeah, these little button covers. These were in one of those job lot bags I talk about all the time, like the chalk was in, and we were going after something else in the bag, and these just happened to be in there, and I'm like, uh, I'll look them up, and look them up, and they bring a few bucks. I'm like, hey, I'll list them. You know, I had four of them total. And uh, somebody bought two of them for three seventy three each, and uh, they paid uh, yeah whatever that is seven forty six for two of these plus shipping. So I have 
resign myself to the fact that there's no correct answer on free shipping calculated shipping so i'm just going back and forth whenever i feel the need <laughs> so take that for what it's worth next up is the dynasty toys laser tag set uh the extreme pack for the model number is t1503 and this was brand new in the package i picked this up for 10 or 15 dollars it wasn't that much uh, at our local thrift store here just a couple blocks from us yeah just brand new sealed up had this for a few months had it listed for uh, 93.75 and then included it in our 30 percent off sale and it sold for the 65 dollars and 63 cents with free shipping and shipping on this was about 12 bucks or so so still really good profit really nice sale next up oh we had the same person buy two of these uh, this one and the next one here this one this Catitudes by Joyce Shelton. This one was the uh, cat with a paintbrush in its mouth uh, and just kind of setting like crisscross applesauce. And this one is a, you know, by the same artist, of course, the fish bowl uh, on a skateboard. Check that out. It's on a skateboard. So, yeah, the same person bought both of these and they did pay full asking of $62.36 each on these. So, it was a hundred and 20 and change plus shipping we did do calculated shipping on those all in all they paid around 100 130 some odd dollars for uh for both of those items so really really super nice sale when we bought these we got like five of them all for just a dollar or two each and we still have the other three but into the big time profit just off the sale of these two so really really nice and next up is the alan edmonds uh slip-on loafers uh these were in okay condition they weren't perfect by any stretch but i only paid like five dollars or seven dollars and fifty cents for these had them listed for forty three dollars and seventy three cents and that's what they sold for full asking plus shipping uh someone in texas bought these and the shipping was ten dollars and fifteen cents so a total of fifty three dollars and eighty eight cents for the allen edmund shoes really nice Next up, the Ralph Lauren Chaps Big and Tall Brushed Flannel uh, 4 Extra Big XB. I uh, got a whole lot of these shirts all at the same time for about 5 bucks a piece. And they've been slow sellers, but that's okay. I knew they would be. Uh, had this listed originally for $49.49 with 30% off, so down to $34.64. Uh, had some watchers on it. I sent out offers of $30, and someone took me up on it. Someone took me up on a sent offer of $30 plus shipping. And they paid nine dollars and 45 cents shipping so a total of 39 dollars and 45 cents and some pretty good profit on the shirt so real good next up is the wii cyclone rod and reel controller the strike fishing game uh, this was a whole kit i paid 20 dollars for this and this is brand new in the box check that out the game was sealed in the plastic there's the rod and reel everything yeah, and I remember buying this specifically because I paid up for it. And I was like, oh, that's kind of a hefty price, but I think it'll be okay. And had this listed for $93.75, included it in our sale, the 30% off sale, and it sold almost instantly when we put the sale on, 30% off. So it sold for $65.63 plus $11.10 shipping. So all in of, what is that, $76.73 on the Wii game. So still some pretty good profit, even though my cost of goods was uh, higher than I would like. Uh, still really good profit on that item. And last item, number 20, is the Crate and Barrel CB2 Tea Light Candle Holder uh, Oval Glass Wall Mount. Sorry about the text messages there. <laughs> um, got these for in a bag literally for a dollar. You know, there wasn't much at all. And uh, had these for quite a while. Had them listed for uh, $16.23 plus shipping. I had best offers on these. Someone sent an offer of 10 bucks plus shipping and I took it. I'm ready to move them on. Still made, you know, good profit on them of, you know, eight, nine bucks or so. Uh, so total with shipping on these items was $21.95. So that is it, guys. That is 20 items that sold on our main account the, on eBay. A uh, big thank you to all of our subscri old subscribers, new subscribers, and everyone in between. A uh, big thank you to our newest patron, Max Hustle. We do appreciate that. You're number three. And for anyone that doesn't know, we are now, uh, we're going to do giveaways for patrons. Um, 
when we get 25 patrons, 25 unique patrons at at least a dollar a month, that's all you have to do is a dollar a month. Uh, we're going to do giveaways every month. And our first giveaway is a Thor Ragnarok Blu-ray DVD digital uh, copy combo. Brand new in the package. I've got it right here in my hand. <laughs> uh, so as soon as we hit 25 $1 patrons, we'll be uh, randomly giving that away to a patron. If you're a $5 patron, like all of our patrons are, we have three patrons. All of them are $5 a month patrons. Uh, they'll have five entries every month into the, the contest, the giveaway. If you're a $10 patron, which is the highest we go, we have $1, $5, and $10. If you're a $10 patron, you get 10 entries every month. So I uh, uh, appreciate that. Every dollar helps us with the channel. Uh, we appreciate it a lot. So check that out. The uh, link for Patreon is in the uh, description of this video and all my other videos. So uh, please consider that. But we appreciate you anyway. We thank you guys. Thanks for watching, and we will see you soon.